Why is that? What is it about a ship that makes reversing around a corner so difficult? When we talk about conventional ships, we basically just mean a bog standard ship with a single fixed pitch right handed propeller and a single rudder that can turn 35 degrees to port or starboard. When running ahead, the propeller creates a fast flow of water over the rudder which simply propels the ship forwards when the wheel is amidships. When you turn the wheel, it moves the rudder which diverts that fast flow of water off to one side. By resolving the forces, we can see that most of the power still goes towards driving the ship ahead, but some of it now goes into pushing the stern sideways and turning the ship. The further you move the rudder, the more of the power that goes into turning the ship rather than driving it ahead. Of course, the rudder will still work even if the propeller isn't running, it's just that the water flow will only be generated by the movement of the vessel through the water. The faster you're going, the more effective the rudder will be. As for running astern, well, things are a bit harder. Because the propeller is located forward of the rudder, when it's running astern, you're pretty much going to lose all ability to steer. Propellers work by accelerating water in a single direction. Effectively, the water particles in the outflow have all been accelerated in a uniform way, but the particles in the inflow are far less uniform. Water is sucked into the propeller from all directions, so you get a far more dispersed force area on the inflow side. Where the rudder was very effective when it was on the outflow side of the propeller, suddenly when you run astern and the rudder's on the inflow side, it's next to useless. The only effect that the rudder will have is that it will mess with the hydrodynamic balance, so you might get a small amount of steering, but it might not be in the direction you think, as it will all depend on the shape of the hull and the surrounding geography. 